Well, Yogi, Washington stared a trap game in the face. <laughs> Said, no problem. Took care of business. They were focused. Every staff preaches this. Yeah. The one and all mindset. But but they lived it. I mean, you got to give them credit. After that dramatic win against Oregon to come in here and it wasn't just workman like it was explosive. They found ways to get turnovers. I mean, they won in every facet of the game. And this team is tracking. The defense is healthy and they're in a great position now into the Apple Cup. You know, they've done most of their damage this year. Washington has offensively with the Michael Penix through the air. They didn't need that tonight. Penix had a good night throws for 229, but they ran for 280 yards. They feel really good about their offensive line. Yeah. Jackson Kirkland being an anchor there. They, they were dominating the line of scrimmage. And as we get into November, you, you've got to be able to win there. I mean, that's how you got to win here, especially when the wind is howling. You saw that in the Oregon State game a couple weeks ago. And I just think this team is feeling really confident. And I think a huge part of that is the seniors, Michael Penix, mm -hmm. his receiving core. But, man, has it bled into every area of this team, even the back end, the secondary, which has been hurt at times this season. Last week, th this team gave up almost 600 yards. They came out tonight. Nothing doing for Colorado. Rivalry games don't generally need anything extra, but this one next week, the Apple Cup, will be wonderful because it's a contrast. You have a brilliant Washington offense, Jake Dickert, and a very good Washington State defense. Yeah, this defense for Washington State is so active up front. They are going to challenge the yeah. edges of UW. You know Washington will have something creative. And then the flip side, how about Cameron Ward? He's playing his best football the last couple of weeks. So if they can find ways to get explosive plays, we might find ourselves in a track meet, much like SC and UCLA was tonight. <laughs> That's right. Well, it was only a three hot chocolate night in Seattle, <laughs> but for the Huskies, they smile as they go to nine and two.